Alright guys, we got a little bit of a longer video for you guys today. And um, we'll see if we can get through the whole thing. Definitely try to get to there. And today we got a little bit of first edition base set. Look at that. Now... First up, we got the Nidoran first edition base set. Now, this does have some whitening over here. So, this is something we would not get graded right away. But because it is first edition base set, we will give you, I think we'll get it graded eventually. Um, it's just definitely not high priority at this point. Now, next up. First edition, another first edition Nidoran. Mm, it's a little better. It's got a, a tiny bit of whitening, but I think they'll let that fly. And I don't know. Can you guys see a difference between? in the two first edition stamps I don't know it kinda looks the same on camera but this one looks definitely a lot grayer so I don't know if that's <clears throat> I don't know I'll have to look it up and see what's going on with that guy um, but luckily the weird one has the better great uh, better quality so that's cool that's Q got a first edition base set card All right, now we got a Charmander from base set it's not first edition but it is shadowless we got a bunch of shadowless today Let's see if we can't get through it pretty quick Honestly, this one's great. I didn't think there was any... I kind of looked through this a little bit before on this Shadowless stuff, and I didn't see much that was really gradable. So, I don't know. We'll see. Yeah, this one's got a lot of whitening on the back right hand corner here kind of see it in the camera next up we got another Charmander um, there's a little bit of whitening here so I don't think that's gonna fly as well we got a Nidorino uh, shadowless see what we can do uh, there's a good bit of whitening down here this is something we may I think you get a nine um, but so I don't want to grade it right now but we may grade this in the future definitely gonna hang on to it see what happens All right, we got Nidorino Shadowless. This one, however, is pretty dang good. There's a little bit of whitening, but I think they'll let that fly. I mean, it's very, very, very slight. So, you know what? We'll go ahead and get that one graded. Got the Nidorino again. Uh, this one's got some serious whitening up here in this right hand corner right off the bat no good got another one again right hand corner no good next up is Vulpix Shadowless there's some significant whitening up in the right hand corner 
Another Vulpix. It's almost damage up there. It's kind of interesting to see that it's, uh, you know, like all the Vulpixes are having problems in this right hand corner. Or like the Butterfreeze, we're having a bunch of problems in the right hand corner. It's kind of interesting to see those kinds of things. This one's actually got some problems in the left hand corner. You can see. Got another Vulpix. No good. Whitening in that left hand corner. Another Vulpix. Um. I don't know. Yeah, I think I'll get this one graded. Alright, we got another Vulpix. Oh yeah, this one's has some pretty significant damage right here on the right right hand side. So that's no good. Another Vulpix. Again. Pretty much damage on this right hand side. And the Vulpix. Um, you know what? Get this one graded. Looks good. It's looking good. Good. All right. Next up. Whoa. I really <laughs> I was trying to hide the first edition stamp. We got Nidorino first edition base set. Look at that guy. Isn't it pretty? Alright. There's some like a significant ding right there. Poor first edition card. Uh, we got another one. Yeah, guys, I was trying to pick up some Nitto King base set stuff um, for the whole evolution chain so I could have like a pair with the um, Nitto Queen evolution line. But uh, first edition is a pain. It's even bigger pain than I thought it would be. I mean, like this card right here. Uh, I think it was like six dollars a piece. You understand? I think the Nidoran was five or like four fifty. Like it's crazy. This is, these are the cheapest prices and the best condition I could find. People just aren't selling them. It's crazy town. All right, there's a lot of whitening on this edge right here. It's no good. Alright, we got a Weedle. There's a lot of whitening on this edge. I don't know if you guys can see it. You can kind of see it there. Got another Weedle. It's no good. I'm widening all along this right end, hand edge. Another Weedle. It's no good. Another Weedle. In case you're wondering like why I buy so many of each. Um, well, this is like the seventh or eighth Weedle that we've looked through and like not one. That's why I buy so many of the same card. Weedle. No dice. Whiten on that same right hand edge there. This one looks like it has a little bit of off centering. You know what? I 
think I'll grade this one. This one's pretty good. Pretty good. Pretty good. Have a code. Kind of the Weedle. Yeah, winding on that right hand edge again. It's crazy. There's some whitening here on the right hand bottom side here. Another Weedle. Huh, this one's actually really clean. Another Weedle. Imagine that. That's pretty good. And we got another Weedle. Now there's pretty good ding right there. So no good. Another Weedle. Um, yeah, there's some whitening on that right hand side. You can kind of see it on camera there. And last card, but not least, we got another Weedle. Is it going to be 10? Not even close. <laughs> Alright. Thanks for watching, guys. You guys have a great day. Have a good